Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about Sam Patterson versus Kiefer Crosby. Sam Patterson 11, 2, and 1. Kiefer Crosby 10 and 4. Sam uh Sam Patterson uh 4 and 1 in his last five fights. The one loss is against the Yanol Ashmiles. It was one of the most vicious finishes I've ever seen. It was absolutely crazy. And the fact that Patterson came back and performed as well as he did, I know the person he fought is dog water, but still the fact that he came back is absolutely awesome because it was such a brutal, brutal finish. It was so bad. Oh my goodness. It was, it was, <laughs> it was really really bad his head was just bouncing off the freaking uh uh canvas oh my goodness um but yeah i, I like this fight I, I i think it's pretty good i think keeper crosby is 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 a weird one because he is older you know uh, let me see right here as we can see some of this, it was really, really bad. It really was. And him waking up afterwards having no idea what had happened. Dude, it was it was brutal. And then Yasho came back and didn't look so good in his, in his next fight. But, man, it was... I, I really wish I could show... The knockout, I think that would, would have been freaking awesome. Um, but it was, yeah, here's the left hook. The left hook that initially dropped him. And then he just went to absolute destruction mode. Holy moly. Whew. Man, was it bad. Jesus. Anyways, came back, got a win against Johan Lenassi. I don't know how people were picking Lohan. Yoan Lenessi to win that fight. He is actually shit. Uh, 28 years old, 6'3 with a 78 inch reach. Fighting Kiefer Crosby's 10 and 4, 2 and 3 in his last five fights. Actually went on two fight losing streak in Bellator. Lost to Charlie Leary by Dr. Stoppage. Lost to Georgie Karakaran Kyra two years ago. And then beat uh, Brian, whatever that name is, 6, 12, and 3. Terrible record. And then beat, this is what got him to the UFC. Be Alex Oliveira, who hasn't had much success out of the UFC, but I'm still happy that he's still fighting. He's a little older now, 36, 37. That guy was really fun in his prime, really fun. And then lost to Kevin Jossett in his UFC debut. Was having some success early and just looked way worse on the ground or in the grappling situations with Kevin Jossett. Kevin Jossett just looked worlds above him in the, in the grappling Plus 275 underdog, 34 years old, 5'11 with a 70-inch reach. It's what? Uh, Jesus. 4-inch height advantage with an 8-inch reach. We already know Keeper Cross is going to be looking to close the distance, uh, look to grapple with Sam a little bit. The problem with that is I think Sam Patterson is a better grappler than Keeper Crosby. Now, Crosby does have that dog in him, but again, he's older at this point, so it's a little different. Seven finishes, he's been submitted two times in his career. He's been finished uh, three times total in his career out of four losses, but Bellatory's finished, TKO'd and submitted, as, as we know. Supposed to fight Thumbo Garimbo, which would have been an interesting matchup, how they would have matched up but i think patterson having the reach the height of being a good grappler knowing how to use his distance i don't think Kiefer has that punching ability to do what yanel did uh to uh, patterson now again like i said the, the interesting thing with patterson is he has 10 finishes only been to decision one time he's one and one in the ufc as we know as we talked about uh but he has really good chokes he has one two three Three rear naked chokes. Three rear naked chokes. He has one, two, three gu guillotines. Um, yeah, he is really good. Three guillotines, three rear naked chokes, and he has uh, uh, five first round finishes. I really like Sam Patterson. I don't necessarily know if he gets a first round finish in this one. 
but I, I like him picking his shots a little bit, knowing that Kiefer is going to have to come to him because he's going to be so much smaller than Patterson. It has to excite Patterson because, again, his style, he, he's pretty good at keeping the distance as long as he doesn't exit with his head up like he did with the ML fight, which is what caught, got him in trouble in that one. Um, he, he, the, the, uh, problems should really show themselves really, but I do think three to one is a little crazy, but I do understand it at the same time because Patterson has every, every, uh, metric to win this fight. He's a better grappler. He's taller. He's longer. I mean, he, again, he's a better grappler. He has more submissions. I like, I like Sam Patterson and I think he gets the job done and Kira Crosby's been submitted two times in his career. Let's see what submissions they were. Arm triangle choke and rear naked choke. Three of Sam Patterson's submissions are rear naked chokes. As always, guys, subscribe, like, comment. Let me know who you're picking. Do you disagree with me? Do you agree with me? Let me know what you're thinking. Peace.